So this is the championship round in the high school level and the uh, City of Orange's Summer League Basketball Championship uh, night at Central. We're gonna, get, we're gonna call from here. You got the signal? You got a signal? Both teams, Orange and the Bad Boys, um, have are in the championship round, and there it goes. Bad Boys with the ball coming out, moving the ball. And here's the, the championship game. He settles for the deep three. And basically, here we go. Orange, Orange and the bad boys. Championship is some central playground. He settles for the deep three. Orange shoots, scores. So Orange Early scores. It go. Three nothing. Orange looking for that bucket. Orange actually scored the first bucket of the game. Oh, you can talk on this one. You can talk uh, on this one. Orange actually scored in the first bucket of the game. Yeah, I seen the deep tray ball. Nah, you gotta come up for him. Sorry about that. Because I can see you go ahead. All right. We good now? Great. Okay. So tonight we got a big crowd here at Central Playground. Uh, both teams are from Orange. Um, before the actual tip-off, uh, Larry Gaunt, who is a member of this community, had passed away. He, he was a coach of the Bad Boys uh, during the summer leagues, and we give our gratitude to his family. And uh, right now it's three nothing Orange. As he missed the second free throw, Orange with possession of the ball, going straight up. And we got the ball stuck on the top of the backboard. So this game is a very rival game because these kids know each other. Yes. They know each other and they're competitive. Like, you know, the other night we seen Orange play West, uh, West, West Caldwell, Caldwell Tech, and, 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 and Orange wanted it more than West Caldwell Tech. And that is why they're here in this position right now with the chance to take the championship belt over here at Orange Central Lab Playground. <laughs> Obviously, it's a trophy, but you know, like, you see the winning belt, it's bragging rights. Yeah. That's what it's called, bragging rights. For the rest of the summer. And when they keep when these kids bragging go back to school. For the rest of the life. Yep. You could say, I won here. Yep. A championship. I got a trophy. Yep. Balling out on this court. Got an yep. interference. Wow. But we still keep so it. So Orange is, is driving. Orange is yep. He settles. A lot. Way to move the ball. He shoots. Shoots, he scores. He goes straight up. Orange, yep. Orange is at the line, number 13. And Orange is taking the lead 5-2 uh, over the bad boys. Oh. Referees are deciding what's going to happen here. We 
We got a tech on the play. Number 13 from Orange. Nails the free throw. Yeah, Orange is Orange is taking the lead. You know, Orange is a tough team. And they've taken a five to two lead over the bad boys. Two shots. And he hits the second free throw. And 7-2, Orange. Correction. Second free throw is good. So this, these teams that Orange know each other, the ball out on the side. Orange is up 8-2. Number 13 goes in for Orange. Looks Way like the Bad Boys defense. It. Bad Boys applying pressure. Yep, they applied a lot of pressure in the last game when they played their opponent. And that's why they're here in the championship round. Uh, Orange just got a tip on it. Bad Boys recover the offensive rebound and finish. 8-4 now. Bad Boys spreading that we got yeah, a travel defense. on the play. Number five from Orange, travel. Bad boys with another bucket. Oh, bad boys recovered, got the ball in. Oh, sold. Inside, basket. We got a it's turnover on the play. Orange retains possession. Looks like these bad boys are, are uh, spreading that defense around against Orange. As bad boys are pressing, still early in the first half. He dishes to the corner, he settles, and it's good. Bad boys taking the ball out on the side. He looks to the wing, he shoots, and it comes off the rim. Oh, bad boys shooting. Orange, re orange Offensive re rebound. Oh, yeah, yeah. And Looks one. Like and one. Scores 11-6. 11 11-8 now. I never want to zoom in, bro. Zoom in. <laughs> Orange is going driving. Looks like you're going to get ready to score a basket here with Bad Boys defense. Orange goes up and he and misses it. Turns the ball over. Bad Boys with possession on a fast break. Overthrows the ball. Orange recovers. As Bad Boys get back on defense, we got a still a very close game 11 to 8. Orange 11, Bad Boys 8. 8.50 left in the first half. We got, a we got a blocking foul on the play. We got a foul on 19 from Bad Boys. Foul on the play. Orange is at the line. Shot that basket, number 10 for Orange. 
It extends his lead from 12 to eight now. Bad boys recover. Take it down point and scores 13 to eight, orange. That boy goes in and scores. It's 13-10. Three point lead by Orange. Oh, that boy scores. It's 13-12. Bad boys Way applying the pressure to Orange. Applying looks pressure. Like it's, oh. Looks like it's gonna get. We got a timeout, I believe, on the court. Bad boys, way to apply out. pressure. 13-12 Orange. The bad boys have cut in the lead. Looks like Orange is getting the ball down the court. Looks like they're about to score again. As bad boys are staying very composed on defense. Very composed. Orange settles for the deep tray ball. Uh oh, didn't it get comes it. off the front bad rim. Boys bad gets boys the ball. pushing the ball forward. Attacking the hole, and he goes up. Comes off short. Still recover the ball. Bad boys still on offense. Looks like it looks like. Orange is trying to Looks spread to the that, corner. That, that, that pressure defense. We got a travel on the play. Orange with possession. Deshaun, number 13 from Orange. Mari settles. Oh. Bad, like boys bad boys recovering the ball. Again. The ball. Looks like, hey, listen, it looks like the bad boys and orange are going to be a competitive game to, to the end. You got your microphone. <laughs> Come on. Bad boys recovering oh. the steal. It looks like it's a competitive game. He pulls it out. He settles. 14 13. It looks like bad boys are. On the comeback trail, it looks like they're, they're spreading it over, and they're, they've taken a lead 17-13 at this moment. Khalid, number 19, bad boys with the last trade ball and the pick. Yep. Will it lead to another bucket? He settles. Settles. Scores, it's the three. I and the score is 20-13. So the bad boys have are drumming orange right now to, to a seven-point lead. The bad boys have gotten a seven-point lead early in the first half with 441 left in the game. First half. Bad boy. Oh, it looks like a pushing foul. Khalid and Khalil. Picking the energy up for the bad boys on offense and defense. Looks like the score is 2013. Bad boys have taken possession and and basically um, it's 2013 right now. Bad boys are scoring. 351 left in the Ramil first half. Ramil on the putback. Ramil on the putback. 
as Orange is bringing the ball up the court, seeking for that bucket and the opportunity to bring the score close. He shoots. We have a foul on the play. Bad boys with the possession. 22-13 right now with 327 left. Anybody's game in the championship round. How you say any last name, Sandler? I believe their last names are Sandler. The brothers. Working. Bad boys dribbling. Feed down low. That's another bucket down low for Ramil. 24-13. 2.56 left in the game. First half. Got a timeout on the court. Both teams are competitive at this time. With 2.43 left, the Bad Boys is winning 24-13. to the court. The bad boys push the ball up. As he tries to feed down low, Orange gets the turnover, gets the steal, leading to to turn it up. I'm about to turn it up. That's the case. I would have been having fun. Bad boys pull the ball out. Number 13 works the ball around the perimeter. Orange's defense is, is, is hovering over him. He feeds the corner. He settles. Left in the game. Off the back of the rim. Goes straight up. Has the chance to put two more points onto the board from the free throw line. Got a minute four. Bad boys are winning 24 15. These two baskets. Uh, missed it. Missed the one. One on one. Looks like defense is spreading. Orange is moving. With 44 seconds left in this first half. Orange is driving. Shoot it. Missed it. Shadows from the corner. Twenty-four seconds. Twenty-four fifteen bad boys. Running clock. Twenty-four fifteen at this moment, and it's a halftime. Oh no, I'm sorry, not the halftime. Twenty-four fourteen, personal foul. 
I was the half. I was the first half. Okay. Bad Boy shoots number 13 from the Bad Boys, 25-15. Number 13 is at the line, shoots another one. 26, 15. We have a running clock here at Central Playground. Orange is losing 26, 15 at this moment. Halftime. Of the Summer League Basketball Championship here at Central Playground. The bad boys are winning 26, 15. Second half. Back to the action. Looks like Bad Boy scored again. It's 28-15 over Orange. Orange has the ball driving. Bad Boys push oh. the ball forward. Got a nice little lay to start the half off. Thirty to fifteen. It looks like the bad boys have a fifteen point lead in this game. And trying to close it in to finish it. Orange settles. That's a nice two from the wing. Bad boys push the ball forward. Oh, all right, all right. Bad boys are just dismantling them. 33 17. Orange to the hole with another two points on the board. Bad boys with possession? Yep. Bad boys with the possession. Orange is trying to recover. Orange gets the ball back. With 13 and, and the clock is running. <laughs> As the sun is starting to set, we are here with the community once again at Orange Central Ave Playground. We got Bad Boys versus Orange. Bad Boys with possession, foul on the play. We have a, a th 13 or some change left in this game and the Bad Boys is winning 33-19. They've been, they've been dominant over Orange all through this entire game. Coke, butter biscuits. Wow, this is three. It's 33 19 now. 36, I'm sorry. 19. Oh, to the wing. Filet! Great little layup. Nice little package. Bad boys to the hole. Orange recovers the rebound. Orange is going to the line with 36-21. Um, clock is running. Um, Orange is trying to get garnered some points. First free throw is no good.
one from as he hits one, the second free throw. Bad Boys brings the ball up the court. We got an offensive foul, an offensive hold. Orange ball. Bucket. Orange again to the free throw line. With the chance to bring the score closer. Orange given another opportunity at the free throw line. I hope. And the free throw is good. As the bad boys push the ball forward, we have a spin move. Layup. Another steal after the layup. As the bad boys are still applying pressure, we got a foul on the play. So right now it's 9.28 left in this game and the clock is ticking and the bad boys are taking extensive lead, 40 to 25. So what's your assessment into this game? If you ask me, man, the bad boys are hustling. They're hustling on defense and attacking the basket very strong, but Orange is attacking too. The bad boys just like they want it more. Orange is trying to pressure some defense like he did in against against West Caldwell Tech, but now it's a walk. Clock is ticking, 8.52 left in the game. The score is 40-27. The bad boy. Orange has the ball. He goes up. Bad boys with the rebound, we got a, we got number five from Orange on the foul. The ball will be taken out from the side. Orange is playing a whole different level compared to West Caldwell. You know, they weren't, they're not rebounding, they're not getting up with the, the shots. You know, that's the, that's the regression to, from the last game to this game. Oh my. Pretty fancy, if you ask me. Oh, oh, the bad boys try to swarm Orange. Uh oh, Orange is going in 13, and he was stripped. We got stripped. a foul on the play. Clock is ticking, 40-27. Bad boys, what a big lead they have right now. Orange is trying to keep in with the game, but apparently, Every time we get an opportunity to uh, get the key shots, the bad boys come up on the defensive level of the game. Well, this is a championship game. Let's not forget that. I expect the bad boys to be hustling on both sides of the court, defense and offense. Same goes for Orange as well. As we said from the first game, it's all about who wants it more at the end of the day. This is all for bragging rights for the rest of the summer. And, and, and both teams know each other real well. That's true. For all. Clock is ticking and the clouds are moving in. And we got a foul on the play. The ball will be taken out underneath. We got a good big crowd here at Central. We have the Orange Police Department providing security. We thank them for coming to the park and doing their, doing their services to the community, to the Orange Police Department. Bad boys, as they came up short off the deep three in the corner. 40-28, 6.25 left. And 
there's a, there's a foul. Bad boys come up with another steal as they go to the basket on a fast. Oh, oh he dunked. It was a miss on the play. Five thirty-five left. Bad boys leading forty twenty-eight over Orange. They settle. That's Shoot another four. three. Bad boys are dominating this game. Forty-three twenty-eight. Orange is playing a way different part game compared to the West Coast hey. game, but they're trying to keep into the game. It's forty-three thirty. Five and some change left in this game. Bad boys are driving, and possession changes over to Orange. There's a lot of talent being displayed out here tonight. We got some former athletes. We have Mike Scott is uh, sitting down below by the basket. Sean Jones, um, you know, Councilwoman Summers Johnson is out here. You know, some April Gaunt Butler, she's a former council person. And, you know, we have some notable people that live in the community, Mr. Summers. Uh, who was born bred orange is out here. He's a, uh, idol icon in the community. So we have notable people in the community are out here watching the young people. Jay Hurt, a former orange high school basketball uh, player is out here in orange. Some of the notables. We got a timeout on the play. And Robert Cole, RJ Cole was coaching his team on uh, Tuesday night, I mean Monday night in the game. And he's a notable in the community. He's a former great basketball player. And his son is currently uh, a former, a current NBA player that's uh, working out, uh, trying to get on the league. We have some notable people in the community tonight that are at this tournament, at this annual event held by the city of Orange. We'd like to thank Mayor Dwayne Warren and members of the City Council, uh, Terry Boyd, who's the organizer of this event. You got zero as of now. Go get it. Go get one. So, um, it's 43-32, 4-17 left in this game. Bad boy, he's 43-32. Great ball oh, movement. Great ball play. movement. Three and some change. That's the most still for Orange. Oh, he goes in, drives. Basket no good, but he will be going to the free throw line. And, we're, and the clock is running with 3.45 left in this game. And, and running clock, Bad Boys winning 45-32 over Orange. Just under three minutes and 30 seconds left on the game clock. We got the bad boys up, 45, orange, 33. Looks like they're dominating orange across the board. Oh, what a great teamwork. As they bad try boy. to get everybody involved. Wow. They're, they're, they're struggling to find the basket. And, and they won't let Orange in. Orange won't let them in. They're playing a way different game compared to they played against West Caldwell Tech on, on Monday. You got to consider the fact that the bad boys are, in fact, bringing the intensity that they need. And they're responding. Outside the three and inside the paint. 
We just have under two minutes left in this game. It's 45-33. First free throw is good. So basically, Orange, this crowd is basically for Orange and the Bad Boys. They're, they're all equipped, entitled, and, you know, they're all actually in the community. They know each other, these kids, and they've been playing since their early ages in high school and two for you know, two grammar, from the free throw. you know, now they're on a high school level. He draws the foul. And they're going for two. With 154 left in this game. Forty-five thirty-five. He misses the second free throw. Orange pushing Orange the ball forward. Orange is looking for baskets right now. Here comes the three. This is it. Rebounds by the bad boys. Draw on the foul. One forty left. There's a volleyball game going on behind us and, and, uh, and uh, a lot of activity going here at Central tonight. There's a volleyball game going on and a basketball championship going ahead of us. We're outside with the community on this beautiful evening. With just under two minutes left on the game clock, we will have a championship for tonight's summer league. Uh, Orange Central Lab Playground. Um, the score is now 49-35 with minute 33. Orange was driving. Orange to the free throw line. Uh oh, here we go. Looks like Orange is getting the ball. Minute 27. From the corner, he settles. Deep wing. Misses. Bad boys recover. They push the ball. Push it. Uh, Orange That's gets the ball over. back. Let him know. Let him know. Hey! Slam! It's oh, a dunk. Head. We've seen a dunk in, in the summer league basketball. Who is that on the court? Hey! With Back the deep forth, response. Duncan. With the deep response, bad boys are definitely picking up the energy on the court. It's a 10-point game, though. 11. 11-point 11 game. Just a minute the crowd left. Is coming in. Oh, oh, look at this. Don't got a box down. Oh, oh. Orange with the basket. 51 42. Bad boys with the ball again. <laughs> the ball is deflected. By Orange, Bad Boys taking the ball out underneath. We're going to talk to him. The kid in the dunk. Talk to the coach. And the twins. And the twins. Yo, boys. Yo, Bo. You can sit down. Paul, sit down. 
Bad Bush came out here with intensity and energy. They hustled on defense and finished layup. That's all I see. Orange was, was just not in the mood tonight. For some reason, they, they played a rough first half, but they fell short of, this, of, the, of the championship crown tonight. But the game's not over yet, though. Anything can happen. Well, this is where memories are made. And the 32nd, six, seven point comeback, that'd be history. That'd be history. <laughs> that would be history. It's history about to be made here tonight at Central Live Playground. I'm William Hathaway, you are? Amir Noel. Thank you for tuning in to our channel with just 35 on the game clock. All right, now, boys, with the final seconds. Final 28 seconds left in this game. So Orange is going to try to put some defense and try to get some points over here. This is the time where you just put oh, it all out. Oh. Whatever you got, make it count. We got a foul, one and one at the free throw yeah, line. Boy's going back to the line again. One and one. The first free throw is good. Fifty-two forty-five. So um, this is like a um, bad boys come up short on the second free throw. It's like Orange the movie Bad Boys. Remember, see the movie Will Smith? Yeah, of course. Bad boys, bad boys. What you gonna do? What you gonna do with just thirty seconds left on the clock? He goes. The drive. Up. Fifty-four forty-five. Okay. The friendly moments of this game. And looks like the bad boys have won it. Final game score, 47-54. 54-47, the final game score. I'm William Hathaway. Co-host Amir Noel. And we thank you for joining us tonight and throughout the tournament. It's okay, y'all want to come as a team, y'all can come as a team. You guys are the 2022 Championship Summer League. How does it feel, guys? It feels good. Light, man. Alley, white. Niggas not fucking though. Hey, yo, follow me on the gram, book.g's, two z's. Nah, we struggle. These struggle buckets, though. What, though? No. Nine and no. All blowouts. All trenches work. All trenches work. All trenches work. We got to think about Trench work. All trenches work. Trench work. It was light. It was light. Y'all want to shout out? Everything for Larry. Everything for Larry. Everything for Larry. Everything for Larry. And my son Gio, man. Gio. Gio. Coach T, Coach G. Yeah. Coach Gio, you're the coach. How does it feel? I mean, it feel great, man. I came out here. I had to do it for my coach Larry, my freshman coach. Uh, that man's like a mentor to me, you know? It's, I had to do it for him. Assembled his team. I had to. I had to. It's all for him. So he was your freshman coach, you said? Yes. So how does it feel knowing that you're like following his steps as a coach? It feels it feels great. I love being a part of basketball. These, these all my like my little brothers to me. The other teams like my little brothers. It's it's that's it. You can't think of, right? Nah. Hey, congratulations, coach. We're looking forward to seeing you in the future. Sit right here. All right, man. Oh boy. Y'all seen that dunk? Woo! Get up with me though. What's up? Get up with me. Just get up with me. Get up. That's all you have to say? Get up. Get up. Just watch all film, man. We coming crazy out here. What? Watch all film on us. 
Trench work. We always in the gym. Valley TV. You know how it go. How did you contribute today? I ain't contribute. I don't give a fuck though. So we still no, win. No, no, no. You couldn't contribute on the sideline. Oh yeah, I was gelling every day. It's all I do. Get it, get people mad hype. Gelling every day. Man, just watch all tape. We all about to transfer schools though. But stay tuned for all of us. We are gonna make it. All right, what was your coach to you, Coach Larry? How was your impact to you? Coach Larry, like, he was always encouraging me to do shit, man. He was inspiring. He used to push me, he told me, go, just keep going. I'm going to be good. I'm going to be great. So, we like that. We like that. Congratulations on the win. Enjoy the summer league. We'll see you next year. Kali. We have our Miss Stacy Bridgman handing out trophies today. Oh, my God. Did y'all say Khalil? Khalil. Jordan B. Jordan B. Jordan H. Elijah. Yeah, yeah. Naquan. I can't read his last name. Who's his last name that's there? Am I missing anybody? I know I miss my own son, Boogie. Top Sean Boyd. Coach Gio. Fellas, fellas, don't go nowhere yet. Hey, hey, bad boys, I need you in the middle of the court for one second. Fellas. Bad boys, I need you in the middle of the court for one second. Again, fellas, you guys had a great season. And like I said, I know that we saw began with Coach Larry. I just feel as though it's honorable that we get this Coach Team trophy for his sister to take on. So I hope you guys don't mind. The 2000. City of Orange, Summer Sizzle, High School Division Champion, 2022, our Honorable Mayor Dwayne Warren. We want to get this trophy to Coach Larry's sister. That way she can take this home, and I remember Coach Larry. Ms. Gard, could you please tell me something on Larry's bath, please? I need you guys to do me a favor, because y'all can go out there with the team and take a picture, please. All right. My name is William Hathaway. I'm with Channel 35. I'm here with the organizer, Mr. Terry Boyd, yes. who has been organizing this event for many years. Terry, explain to me how, how did this come about? Well, it came about a long time ago. I want to say I've been doing this now for 25, 30 years. For 30 years. This will be my 30th year. Um, like I said, I just wanted to give back to the kids for the many years that when I was playing, I had people do it for me. Mr. Al Thompson, Pat Hammond. So I wanted to give back to the kids. And when they gave me the opportunity to take over the program, I took over the program and I never looked back. I just want to give our kids something positive to do, keep them off the streets and keep them positive and doing what they do. I know we have a lot of talent here in Orange and your your family isn't greeted into it and and, uh, and, this, and and there's rivals, you know what I mean? These kids with the bad boys in Orange, they're rival yes, kids yes. and they're, you know, neighborhood kids. Yes, all of, them, all, of them, all of them for Orange. So like I said, to see them both be here and be in a championship game meant a lot today. And like I said, we did a lot of things, what's called the team, like I said earlier, the team, the bad boys, was originated by Mr. Larry Gaunt, which was one of the assistant coaches for the high school team. And of course, we know he passed away. So it was, it was a great honor today for the bad boys to be able to win the championship and honor him.